What up, people? It is Shadow Avenger, and today we're going to be talking about the next generation of consoles, and in specific, we are going to be talking about the Microsoft Xbox 360. We're not going to be specifically talking about it, but the successor, professionally talking. Um, as you know, there has been a lot of talk during the YouTube and other communities in the media. Um, the Xbox code name is called Project Durango. And just like with the Kinect, it was that was called Project Natal. And I think the Wii was called uh, Project Revolution. And that sounds a better name than the Wii. The Wii's a stupid name. I don't know why they show this Wii. But, you know, um, I, I hope they changed Durango because I don't want Durango being the name for the next Xbox 360 or the next Xbox. I rather prefer the Xbox 720. So today we'll be talking about the, um, what you know. Will the next Xbox have disc trays? You know, or you know, disc or downloadable content. You know, just just that for your gaming. So I I think they're not going to. But in the next five, I would say next five years five to ten years I would say is when they would start putting um, d disc no disc in consoles and as I read and looked more in more information in this subject Microsoft does not want to start not having disc trays or like no, no use games in in the um, in their ex in the Xbox so the only problem well, the problem about this is that businesses, businesses like GameStop will lose money and get out of business. I don't know if they will get out of business, but um, uh, GameStop is a you know um, multi-million dollar company that in the U.S. I don't know if they have in other countries, but GameStop, you know, they're known for selling games and buying and like buying from people. So a big profit comes from buying and when you sell the sell your game to them and when they get the game they're making profit so you see they, they, you sell a game for they get it for 10 they sell it for 12, or 12 so they make a two dollar profit out of it may see nothing to do but they're making money and that's how GameStop has become big like that so if the next Xbox 360 or the next um the next generation of consoles like the Wii the next Wii the, like the Wii U or the PS4 and the Xbox 720 if they don't have uh, disc trays then you know you just have to buy a credit card you know that that's a very bad idea because a lot of people are insecure they don't like to buy with credit cards because you know the interest I don't, I don't, I'm only a kid I don't know nothing about credit cards really and not until I have one that's when you truly know so it's no uh, GameStop might get out of business because of this and they're also talking about um, how used games will not be allowed so use games obviously you're gonna have to have a disc ready you have to use games so they're probably gonna have this this they're probably going to have this phrase but maybe not um, allow use games in the disc tray and the bad thing about this you're going over your friend's house it's like hey dude I just got the new Call of Duty 10 today and uh, I want to bring play over your house you know and you know they can't play it because they have to bring their Xbox, and that's such a hassle to bring. Where it could just bring a game, and I see this working only if uh, if you um, if you bring the game. If when you download the game in your console, it's attached to your account. This probably will make sense, but you never know. So that's how it will, it will assume. So what I'm thinking as a good idea for maybe the next generation consoles to because they want less they want to spend less money and want to do all that stuff just buy like a USB stick in GameStop so they won't go out of business with the game you install it in your Xbox and you know once you install it it stays in your Xbox and in, in your account the same well as well so with this this is the best solution I hope they do whatever they can to make make the Xbox cheaper and better affordable and I you know, I hope you guys like this commentary. I hope you guys check me out. Tell me what, tell me all about it, and I wonder if I should do more about this. I'll put the link in the description of the article. Peace.